After a very pleasant stay sheltering at Fitzroy Island, the weather forecast showed lower winds. So it was time for us to sail on to Cairns where we planned a longish stay to catch up with some family and friends as well as taking in some of the sights of the region. First though, we had to navigate the shallow, twisting and very narrow entry into Blue Water Marina. Definitely a bit daunting the first time around. Well, we've been here at Fitzroy Island for a week with the wind blowing 25 to 30 knots from the southeast. It's been seven days of great beaches, fantastic rainforest walk, and Foxy's Bar and Bistro to chill out at. It's been a magic stop, but now it's time to drop the mooring lines and sail over to the most northerly stop of our Great Barrier Reef travels this season. We've booked our dream time into Blue Water Marina just outside Cairns. We're going to leave the boat for a while and play tourists on land. Came out with the reef main today because the wind has been a lot higher than what the reports were showing from Cairns. So we thought we'd just err on the side of caution. We haven't got far to go, 19 miles. See what happens once we get around the point. Because with our in boom uh, rolling furler system, it's not hard to shake that reef out and just put the rest of the main up if we want it once we're in the protection of the mainland. with us, is it? I don't like that. Did a big jump out of the water. Hello. Good morning, how are you? Not bad. Good. What time are you expecting in? Uh, We're <laughs> coming in the channel now. Oh, right. I've got your pin number. I'm going to help you fill it out. Yeah, Charlie 4. Charlie 4. Okay. Yeah, yeah we're, we're literally just coming through the first red and green just outside um, the Yorkies Knob Marina. No worries. Okay. Okay. See ya. See ya. Thanks, mate. Uh, 
sitting in the Blue Water Marina and yeah, it looks pretty skinny up there. <laughs> skinny. Holy crapola. 2.5 metres of water, we need one and a half to float. 2.7. Got better. Yes. But the, these are skinny little. They tell us that the channel has been dredged. I hope so. We're at a 1.3 meter low tide at the moment. <coughs> the arches. Have Having fun on the wheel? Yeah, we have surf beside us because there are sand banks right there. I'd hate to be over there at the moment. Just keep an eye on the depth, 2.7 yep. at the moment, so that's 1.2 metres under the keel. It's going to have a tidal run with us as well, which is, um, I should say, against us. I thought we'd have slack by now. I can certainly feel the tidal pull. So I see that I'm going to have to do a dog leg through here. Around the sandbags, the bags, bags, <laughs> so if you like. <laughs> yep. And a complete U-turn. Yes. And the green marker over there is actually on the sand. Okay, we're at 3-1 here, 3-2. Stick in the channel. Yeah, I can see the sand bank just to my starboard. It looks deeper once we're past those marks. Awesome! That's good news. <laughs> Just line up the centre. Hopefully there's nothing coming the other way. Because I'm not giving way to them. I think our berth should be a blow on to so a feel it. So green is there in the middle and I should have a red on the other side somewhere. This is my U-turn back on ourselves. 4-2. I'm breathing. Staying over there, I can see it's deeper over. No red on our port side. Nope. Just a big sandbar. Okay. Start going to port. Yep, I'm going. You can see the sandbar sticking out there. that we um, bring the dinghy into, not necessarily our dream top. We're at 3, 7, 3, 8, so we're still all good. 3, 9. There's no sandbag on the starboard side, just jumping out. Yeah. 
Lovely egret underneath the um, bushes to the start. Yeah. Hello, matey. It's a bit shallow over there, obviously. Coming up to our next U turn. Three six. Repeat three six three five three four. Roger that. Drop to three. Yeah, all looks good. I'm going to come back and um, take over the wheel so you can get shoes on, etc. For ready to step off. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I'm going to get these fenders down. Play the restrain by draft rule. Right? And double check all your lines, love, so you're happy with them. We are at 2.8. Stand one's fine, just check this, see how I've got it tucked in there for you. Thanks mate. We have three meters. I can see the pinch point. That'll be getting past the black motorboat and then past the first of the catamarans and then it looks deeper again. You keep hanging on just in case we stop. down the finger and do a turn to port. Three point two in here. Man, they're a bit tight. Can you see C? Yeah I can see C. I can see C. There is Roger and Dan on the dock waiting. Yes. The fingers are a bit tight. Goodness, where is that? So I can see, see. We go down there and four and five are open. How far in? Oh yeah, got you down a bit. Most of the way. The numbers start at the shore and work out. the other blue one. Yep, it's now. And there's a horn at the end, so all good. Get him to take the bell on. Yeah. All good? 
Okay, do you want to do you want to set that up there? Because that's good. Your anchor's not sticking out. Come on, mate. Come on, mate. We're on. We're on. We're dragging chain up there. No, I'm waiting for you guys to get. <laughs> hey, mate, I made a decision. Bloody hell. Hello. Hello. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. It's going to have some rain and We're nice and close to the bar. I like that. Yeah, it's very good. Yeah. The entrance to Blue Water Marina is a little daunting, particularly at low tide. But it's that winding creek that makes this the most cyclone protected marina we've found on the tropical coast. With our dream time nicely secured with the assistance of our friends Roger and Jan off Opportunity, we could now happily leave her in safety while we enjoyed some of the many incredible experiences to be had in this region of far north Queensland. Join us next episode to see more. If you're enjoying our videos, please make sure you give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. It really does help us with YouTube to reach more people. If you also hit the bell button, you'll be notified each time we release a new episode. Come sail with us again soon.